helicopters are remarkable machines that can perform missions that very few other aircraft can. Firefighting, emergency medical services, and even cattle herding are all improved by using helicopters. Heads up, because in this video, we will showcase 4 amazing next generation helicopters that you never thought exist. If you don't want to miss any of these incredible innovations, keep watching the video. Let's start off with the initial candidate designs. At a conference in April 2019, the U.S. Army Aviation Association unveiled the candidate design of AVX and I-3 technologies. AVX, L-3 technologies, Bell, Boeing, Karam, and Sikorsky received the Army candidate design contract. The helicopter has a side-by-side -side cockpit, primary compound coaxial rotors, and tail ducted fans for forward and reverse propulsion. Textron Bell's CEO said their Farrah arrival would use 525 technology instead of V280 tilt rotors. Bell's 360 Invictus competed with the Farrah in October 2019. Now, let's dive into these amazing next generation helicopters. Number 1 the Raider X. The Raider X's S97 radar aircraft X2 compound coaxial technology boosts speed, battle radius, payload, and aircraft types to accomplish mission goals. Sikorsky unveiled photographs of its Raider X prototype helicopter with Hellfire missiles and a 20mm main gun. Few slage images from West Palm Beach Faro Country Hangar. The aircraft's chin houses the three barreled primary rifle. Folding the helicopter's modular effects and launchers decreases drag. Sikorsky President Paul Limo said the transformational Raider X will offer the Army the lowest scheduled risk and highest technical maturity among Faro competitors with X2 technology. Expand Raider X. We will help the military deter dangers and defend liberties into the 21st century. The aircraft's modular open system avionics and mission systems allow computing sensor plug-and-play armaments. Sikorsky Director of Business Development Jay Macklin said the Raider X delivers the Army operational adaptability, including speed where it matters, a large modular weapons bay, and remarkable acceleration and deceleration. As the most agile, lethal, and survivable vertical lift aircraft, the Raider X dominates emerging threats. Number 2 Future Attack Reconnaissance Aircraft the U.S. Army is trying again to get a new scout helicopter, even though it has been lost for decades. The Army stopped doing dedicated aerial scouting when it retired the Bell OH-58D Kiowa Warrior helicopter in 2017. The new rotor craft is meant to bring that job back. In 2018, Dr. Bruce D. Jetty, the Assistant Secretary of the Army for Acquisition Logistics and Technology, told the press about a plan for a fly off between people who want to be pharaoh. The Army thinks the new helicopter will not be used until at least 2028. Considering that the military has already shown it can't make a new scout, that's not a very long time in military terms. Number 3 OH-58 Replacement History the military failed to replace the OH-58D for over 20 years. In the 1990s, the U.S. Army commissioned Boeing and Sikorsky to build the RAH-66 Comanche, a stealth helicopter that was not stealthy. 2004 saw the last Comanche. After the OH-58D success, the service offered Bell the contract to build the ARH-70, a non-stealthy scout with a similar design but better technology. Bell and Boeing blamed each other for program delays and cost overruns. So, the Army discontinued the ARH-72. The U.S. Army experts called the Pharaoh the knife fighter of future military aviation because of its high performance in a tiny package. Pharaoh must employ government-issued weapons like the GA-1901 enhanced turbine engine and specialist 20mm gun and a missile launcher to defeat robust Russian or Chinese air defenses. Pharaoh must glide over city streets, hide behind small obstacles, and have a minimum speed of 180 knots and a maximum rotor diameter of 40 feet. 
Number 4. Bell Invictus 360. The main rotor of the Bell 360 Invictus is a shrunk down version of the articulated 5 blade rotor developed for the Bell 525 Relentless, a super medium lift to an engine commercial helicopter for the offshore industry. The Invictus, which made news upon its introduction because of its sleek form, is reminiscent of the RAH 66 Comanche. Recent images show the Invictus's sleek, rounded fuselage with a single black tail roller and an interior armament stored to lower radar signature improve your reflexes and agility rely on advanced sensing targeting technology and next generation long-range precision airstrike weaponry the missiles and launch tubes on the racks appear to be reproductions of the AGM-114 Hellfire and AGM-179 Joint Air-to-Ground Missiles. The generic word launch tube applies that various types of explosives and air launch drones can be placed inside. And that completes our video for today. We hope you enjoyed learning the four amazing next generation helicopters that you never thought exist. Which of them impressed you the most? Tell us in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more content such as this.